I I know some people don't like to use their old tag, so I try to change it. I still got a lot of respect for for Asta, aka formerly known as Gao. He was definitely one of those great players, even in offline, kind of one of those hidden bosses that you might run into pools. Sometimes getting top eight at MSM, top nine. Yeah, main thing that I like about him is that he's really good with a lot of different characters. Yeah. Like characters that don't even really make sense to like use with each other. Yeah. Right, I've seen him play Sonic, Hero, Pit, Cloud, Bale. Oh, oh he's so dead. Yeah, he's what dead. the heck? Wait, what percent was that? Hello? Wait, what? So Wait, chance. no, I mean before the hit. Oh, I don't know. I didn't see. I Bro, kinda, no, he I... definitely died way too early. That's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> anyway, this actually looks like a good matchup for Hero. Because he has the, I don't know, his, his thunder move. That covers like half the screen, so he can hit Steve while he's char like you no know, mining stuff. Yeah. He has a reflector. He has a disjoint. He has this move that makes him insanely fast and has crazy like aerial drift. Yeah. Like, actually, this, this is... looks this looks really bad. <laughs> this actually looks really yeah. bad. The full charge. Yeah, and then, for... and then this is fine too. See, like situations like this where a lot of characters are like, oh man, Steve's camping me. But then like heroes like, oh, you're camping me. I don't care. I'm just gonna down B. <laughs> like, <laughs> I'm just gonna roll all the specials I want, like all the spells I want, and then yeah, we'll be good. <laughs> he basically he basically gets the mulligan all the cards in the deck from the best one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Literally, that's the best thing that like you can get. No, yeah. Yeah, that... there, there is the thunder covers so much of the screen. Yeah, but I like that, that setup. Full so charge because Zap is really, really strong. Definitely like one of the strongest moves in the game for sure. It does require a lot of charge up, but at the same time, if you do pull it off, it's it can eliminate stocks really easy. It's definitely something to worry about. But yeah, look at the way that Ast is just playing here. He knows like, I have the lead. If if literally if Steve wants to go for all the mining tricks, that's okay by me. I literally have the lead and all the time and all of the randomness that I can pull off, like you said, sorry, it's it's kind of okay for him. Yeah. Okay, nice catch on the rolling. He should edge guard him here because he has almost no mana. Oh wow. He didn't try to go for it. I like his up B use. It, he hasn't gotten it to kill yet, but that auto cancel window is so good for Steve. Yeah. He can like act out of it immediately. I think he can even edge cancel it too. Oh, nice. That was actually a really good roll punish. I don't think I've ever seen a hero do that before. To use up B in that way. But it's really good on this stage. Oh no. Oh he no. Just, yeah. yeah, disconnection um, error on our end. Dude, this happens every time. <laughs> well, guys. Um, so, how is everyone's Monday so far? Well... Are you guys if, having a good time? I was gonna chat? say, I was gonna say, like to be fair, Nintendo did just announce, or we just found out today, like on Twitter, that the server is about 18 years old, and they're actually being replaced within the next month, within this month. So I was gonna say, like, the servers are old, but definitely it's good to know that they're getting replaced, and hopefully the next set of servers will be better and won't get us disconnected. Even though Smash has patched this issue at least twice by now. So that's really crazy. I hope everyone's Monday is going great. And I hope everybody's who's watching this YouTube bod uh, is having a good time. I think there, it matters if they have different servers because um, um, the way that Smash works, like, isn't it peer to peer anyway? Like, I don't think it, does it really matter? <laughs> Oh, oh, the other person was streaming. I didn't know that. We could have just watched it. But I saw Gale won the first match. Oh, sorry, Asta, Asta won the first match. Okay, I was like, I don't want to go through the trouble of like waiting for an ad and then get to the stream. And then by the time I get there, the match is almost over. Oh. What? Okay. I mean, if everyone's crying about it, I'll uh, unplug my fire alarm somehow. I'm sorry. <laughs> if it's really that annoying. I was gonna say, Star, it's like, you should, uh, you should definitely... You should definitely get that taken care of, man. 
I think that's what he's doing because he's not talking. That's the only thing I hate about fire alarms is when they're on low battery, they make that chirping sound and they have to make it. And the worst thing about some fire alarms is they're in very hard to reach places. So it's like, come on, man. Like not only are you, is the fire alarm so annoying, but it's like in a hard to reach place that you have to like dedicate this time. So I forgive strides on that one, but I always make sure my fire alarms are up to pace at least. Alright, well, game two here between Asta and Adachi. Oh, this is a really good aerial carry here. A couple up tilts here. And this does put Asta off the stage all the way to 74. In a bit of trouble. I like that option, though. Decides to go for the jump to avoid the TNT. But unfortunately, stepping over the trap. He does eat 91 up to 91%. Kaboom, that does have a win box that sucks you back in. Really difficult to get around here. That's the one thing I have to give it to Asta also. He's really cautious on the mash out. If you mash out poorly on the minecart, it is a really good follow up for Steve. So you have to kind of respect it. There is going to be the zoom free recovery towards center stage and the free aerial as well. Bank to stop the minecart. I definitely like this from Asta. He's looking for a little bit more stage control, avoiding a lot of the hits from Steve. Down smash? Wow, what a great play. Asta stealing the stock all the way from the ledge. Oh no, that's yeah, that's rough. He got sent into a tech situation at that point. That up smash is gonna take care of it all. Couple up tilts here. This is big with this with the iron axe. Good mash out. Good combo for Steve. The psych up. He's still got the recovery. He's going to have to commit to the full win one year. Double jump mix up here just to kind of time his way back onto the center stage. And that's good for Asa too because he's well aware of like, okay, I need to be careful how I come back center stage. And also respect a lot of options from Steve. With Accelerate, this will allow him to just have the extra speed to get around characters like Steve. And even then, we talked, me and Strat talked about it earlier. Even when Steve mines for items, it's still good for Hero because look at this, all these buffs that he's been able to cast on himself. Okay. Oh, overcome I, him in here. I I unplugged my fire alarm from my room, but if if you guys hear other fire alarms in the house, I can't do anything about that. I have to literally get like a ladder and then go to my ceiling, and I don't I don't I know it's annoying, but I don't want to I don't want to go through all that trouble. I'm sorry. Anyway, um, so this matchup is going much better. Yeah. For Adachi. I don't know, I guess it's the stage. It's a little bit easier for him to move around on this stage because like the Valkyrie platforms, it made it really easy for uh, Ass to just stay around all of his setups, I guess. Yeah. I like that. I like the cart through the little opening between the the blocks. And the That's opening is really good too because it makes it narrow enough that only certain projectiles can pass through. That's a really good catch in the center platform. Okay, not enough. Oh, I got scared of the bounce and the anvil there. But it looked. Oh! <laughs> Take this man to bed. Put this man to sleep. <laughs> I've never seen that before. I never, I never saw uh, Steve fall asleep before. I didn't know that he goes inside of a bed. Oh, my God. Oh, he did it again. <laughs> oh. oh no! Okay. All right, go. All right, I gotta calm down. I'm sorry. That was really funny. <laughs> Man, he's trying but, uh, to read. Steve, he's trying to read Steve a bedtime story. Hold the phone. Oh, oh nice. Back got the diamond yeah. back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he's so dead. Dang, that almost turned around really, really badly for a dodgy. 
Yeah, that almost did. And unfortunately, Asta lo losing literally like two good smash attacks. That allowed Adachi to actually make this comeback. Nice. That was oh. really good. Uh, <laughs> that was really good um, adaptation from Adachi. Because the first game looks horrible for him. Like, actually terrible. Like, he couldn't do anything. But, uh, yeah, I know I know Asta plays a lot of characters, but I think he should stay hero in this matchup. His hero yeah. seems like he has the most options versus Steve. Yeah, hero definitely has the most options, and it's also, like we mentioned earlier, when Steve sets up the tower of all the Minecraft blocks, literally, Asta just gets time to mulligan all the cards in the deck for the best ones. And all the good buffs. Like, we saw that he was able to go over it with Accelerate. He was able to slip through with things like Zoom and still make recoveries because he had used other cards. Or basically other, like, you know, RNG moves. So, it's really good for Asa to just stay this matchup. The only character that I can see him probably going to is Pit. Just for the arrows because he can slip them through the blocks as well. But I think the fact that Hero does so well in the matchup is, is, much, is much of a better play, I think. Yeah, and also I I really want to see this matchup. It's pretty funny. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, this is actually a really hilarious matchup to watch. Like, this game is crazy when you think about it. How are we watching this? Steve versus the Dragon Quest guy? Like what? Dude, it's not just Steve. It's like a Sephiroth versus the Minecraft guy. Yeah, it's, that's it, 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 it's like I have to tell somebody. I have to go like take a time machine, go back five years and tell them my past self from five years ago that in the future, there will be a matchup such as Sephiroth versus Steve in Smash. And I would have told them that he's a liar. Yeah, I I honestly didn't believe that Minecraft anything would ever be in Smash, let alone all these other characters. Yeah. And there's still more characters. Yeah, there we has, have three like, more I characters. Like the last character, like the last DLC character is gonna be someone that like no one will ever expect. That's my that's my gut feeling. I'm with you on strides, man. But let's see what your gut feeling says about one one Aster versus Adachi King three here. Oh, he got to go back to battlefield. Oh, and that was a good stage. That this is the first stage that Asa actually played played in, and definitely the first victory he got. So we'll see how it goes. But we'll see. I think Adachi's figured a few things out about the matchups too, so maybe he's just comfortable going back here now that he uh, knows a little bit more about how uh, Asta's playing. I think off the bat though, he really likes the platform layout for that up B, up tilt setup. Also, his sword moves like cover a lot of the <laughs> project the platforms too, so yeah. it kind of gets hard for Steve to approach just because he just doesn't have the range really. Like, even with the startup of hero's moves, it's just the fact that it has so much area to cover can be difficult. But oh, nice Ooh, setup! Wow, yeah, that was excellent setup. That there. was crazy good. What the heck? <laughs> that was so smart too to take the jump while being on the the blocks like that, and then get the the card to finish it off too. Like that was nice. That was actually really good resource management too. But oh my god, he got the buffed dash attack. I think. Yeah. <laughs> he just just cut him down to size. But I mean, if Adachi's gonna be able to get as much mining materials like that in this matchup, it's good that he's able to capitalize when he can. He almost got the double forward air too. That would have been really bad for Asta. Like, oh no. Yeah. That's rough on, nice. on Asta here because he directional air dodge. That would have been a good combo for Adachi just to put in more percent, but nonetheless, he's Let's got go. 88 on Asta. Oh, Forced to go for the recovery. That's a lot of what coverage the? there. What happened? Why did the TNT pop up like that? <laughs> it's, it's, it's the way it's the way that the anvil actually sends it because it's the, <laughs> yeah if the tnt gets hit it does pop up a little bit otherwise that will stay stationary if the tnt takes too much damage it will explode what what dude i don't know what this character is doing right now it's so funny it's so funny to watch steve okay this is a huge lead though yeah that's just gotta really really pull something together here because he also has the threat Ooh. of... Oh, wow, it reflects the down smash. That's good to know. Down yeah, this is good for, this is good for Asa, too. Yeah, look at this. Yeah, it reflects the card as well, too. 
If I was him, I would be perfectly fine with hanging back like this and just keep farming for bounce. Yeah. That's what I would do. If you, if you have to oh. go for that to get the W, man, it's whatever it takes. Gets the zoom in, not towards the ledge, but he's able to make the solid recovery in the play around Steve. Like you said, Steve Sarge, is, I, I think at this point... He's controlling the whole stage right here. Yeah, he's but, controlling yeah. the whole stage, but Asta's looking for that bounce yet again. And I think that's what he's... I think that's the move for him here. Oh, no so back air. I like that. No, no oh. punish there, but he takes the stage instead. Good trade off. Because at this point, with Austin being at a higher percent, I think he's just looking forward to make a play for center stage and try to hold that. Oh, he didn't get the right hit of the up B, so it couldn't combo into up smash this time. All, All right, right bounce is, and play. Oh, you got bounced now, yeah. But yeah. uh, yeah, any, anyone can take the stock right now. It's very scary for both players. I like the the wall he's putting up here though. Oh. Oh, try to get Tech Chase off of the block. <laughs> yeah, he's not really using the projectiles that much. Yeah, he's just waiting for the bounce to go away. Oh, there's a cart. Oh, yeah. diamond. That pickaxe. was actually so good timing because um, Asta could have like mashed out faster to avoid the forward air there, but uh, Adachi just followed him the whole time. Yeah, that was nice. Oh, he's so scared of up tilt. <laughs> oh, the combo. Ooh, it's the diamond X too, so it does even more damage. Oh yeah, this is huge, huge, huge lead. Oh, he's trying to chase. You're a little bit too slow in the air though. He's got the bounce, okay. But I think a dodge at this oh, point. No. Oh, the diamond forward smash with punish. Damn, that was so strong. Nice, nice catch. Wow, that was a really, really good uh, set for a dodge. I like that a lot.